Alright, okay, welcome back to another video. Anime Wars has finally released about like about 10 minutes ago, and it's time to try out the game. I know one month ago when I tried out the Anime Wars revamp, a lot of people didn't like the revamp because it was buggy as hell or something. But me personally, I enjoyed it. I played the PvP and I actually liked it, except for the combat. The combat was atrocious, but the little PvP system with the rankings and like placement matches and stuff, that stuff was pretty cool. And the banner summoning system and all that stuff, it was all looking really good. The visuals were amazing, but, but sadly, it was one of those situations where the gameplay didn't match how the game look but it's finally out today and we're gonna see if the combat has changed so let's go ahead and try it out make sure you guys hit the sub button like this video i'm probably gonna be live streaming this game on my twitch later tonight maybe maybe not i'm not too sure so don't forget to follow me on twitch i play a bunch of random different games from time to time on there and also don't forget to use star code and finance when you buy robux or buy premium and without further ado hit the sub button like this video and let's go ahead and hop in game all right, here we are. Anime Warriors release. Oh, I hope there's some cool units on the banner or something because I don't want to use the same units as last video. And honestly, I'm not even sure if I'm even going to do adventure mode in this video. I'm probably just going to go straight into PvP. But, um, let's see. Let's just press adventure for now. All right, you got the dailies and stuff in here. You got Zoro and Gara in the dailies right now. And let's see, who's on the banner right now? Oh, it's still the same units. Damn, why did they change the banner? What the hell? They definitely should have changed the banner before releasing the game, but whatever. There's a battle pass now. Interesting. Let's see. There's a lot of pretty cool stuff in here. Is there any units in here? Uh, these are all emotes and sit-ups and stuff. This is all I see right now. Um, Body-ups, sleeping. What's at the end of the banner? Oh, Narukami Sage Mode Naruto. You can purchase all this with Robux. 14k? Yeah, that's dead. <laughs> but uh, let's go ahead and buy the battle pass i guess it costs 800 robux yikes okay whatever all right there we go we got battle pass tier one Ooh. all right what is this oh you get modder for free from the battle pass wait what that's interesting he's the first unit up here i think so i guess when you buy the battle pass you get modder for free that's pretty good i didn't know that because it doesn't say modder is like the first thing on here it says battle pass hero oh it doesn't tell who it is but i i guess this is modder i don't know why it says four stars but he's actually a six star unit all right yep here he is this is modder let's go ahead and equip him let's replace um zenitsu for now all right so we have modder right here okay so um we could do adventure and do this stuff but honestly i'm not gonna do that this video i don't want this video to be boring i'm probably gonna do that stuff when i grind while i play on twitch or something for now we're gonna go straight into ranked and play some pvp yeah my wins and losses are still here from uh last open test uh let's go ahead and go to matchmaking i guess not sure if we have to do our placement matches again but we probably do i don't know i probably should have tested if moderate is even good before i went to pvp but honestly i don't really care i doubt moderate is that bad there's no way you go wrong with Madara. so let's go ahead and try him out all right let's see moderate's skills first Three, skill is gun by two, two's one, grand cleave go! three shattered heaven and four is rib cage combo all right he said wait Boy, I am not waiting. <laughs> All right, that ribcage combo. Okay, nice. Um, oh, what the hell? Grand Cleave, what does this do? Damn, that thing is huge. What's Shattered Heaven do? Oh, that drops a meteor. All right. <laughs> I don't think the combat's changed at all. It doesn't uh feel any different. Oh, that's a an evasive. What the hell? What does this do? All right, let's use ribcage combo on him. Okay, he's dead here. Yep, yep. And he's dead. Okay. Yeah, the combat still kind of feels the same. If I remember correctly, you have to hold E to do an air combo. Or is it Q? I don't know. I can't remember. Let's see. Grand Cleave. Oh, okay. That's not a guard break. There, I dropped a meter on him. All right. Let's see. How do I do air combos again? Okay. It's not holding E. I can't remember how to do it. All right. It's ribcage combo. Oh, this guy's messing me up now. Shattered Heaven. Oh, the meteor missed. The meteor only drops in front of you. Oh, yeah. I'm dead here, I think. Yep, I'm dead. Damn. Oh, I can just force spawn. Yeah, let me do that. Let's see. Let's see. I think the gun by moves a reflection. Yeah, this is a counter skill. All right. There you go. Sweep him away. Let's use Shattered Heaven. There you go. Drop the meter on him. And he's dead. All right. Um, I don't feel a difference when it comes to the PvP. I'm not going to lie. The combat kind of does feel the same. I don't know if there's anything different about it, but it doesn't feel different. There you go. Nice. I'm on I, I forgot how to do air combos, bro. Let's use this. Oh, Grand Cleave miss. Gun by. There you go. It's a counter. Shattered Heaven. Nice, drop the meteor on that boy. Uh, let's use ribcage combo. Okay, yeah, that didn't work. Okay, so it's E for evasive. Dude, what keys air combos again? I forgot. I don't know if there was a tutorial, but I should probably go do that before I uh, play this mode. There you go, he hit the counter. All right, this guy's pretty much dead. Nice, shattered heaven. Yep, GG. Oh, wait, I can actually aim the meteor. I didn't know that. Okay, let me get out of this. Come on. Okay, I subbed. Okay, he blocked all of that. Let's see, counter. Oh, he didn't hit my block. There you go, he's dead. Grand Cleave killed him. 
All right, there we go, GG. All right, that was an easy first match. Oh, okay, so season, oh, okay, I ranked up. Okay, yeah, you don't have to do placement matches anymore. If you play during the uh, the open test, me, I already played during the open test, so I don't have to do placement matches. But if you didn't, you would have to. All right, uh, let's go back to the lobby. How much battle pass rank did that give? Oh, that didn't even give me a lot, yikes. Oh, you can get four star Gar for free as well, and you get five stars Zenitsu for free as well. And it says God of Destruction, I'm pretty sure that's Beerus. And you get Sage Mo Naruto. All right, it's a pretty good battle pass. My only problem is that they didn't change the banner before releasing the game. They should have changed it. Oh, it says M2s for air. Oh, that's how you do air combos, I think. Let me go test that out in Adventure real quick. We're gonna do one Adventure mode. All right, so the game said I just do an M1 combo and an M2 at the end of it, I think. There we go. Okay, so yeah, it's um third three m1s and then you m2 all right let's go ahead and finish this this modder is pretty good though i don't really see a problem with the modder he seems pretty strong honestly so uh, after this match i'm probably just gonna grind pvp the rest of this entire video but it just sucks that they released and they didn't change the banner i was hoping for like a new unit on release to try out in uh the banner but i guess i got this new modder from the battle pass i guess i guess all the new units that they were working on all went into the battle pass which is of course um the God of Destruction Beerus and the Sage Mo Naruto and um, this Madara. It kind of seems like they just neglected the uh, banner. And this Madara is looking pretty strong because this AoE damage is crazy. Yeah, this is easy. I can easily just clear all this with this Madara. And I'm going to skip most of this because this is boring to watch. So I'll be back once I finally get back into PvP. All right, final round. Wait, what the hell? I got to fight you, Kaku? Wait, since when was this a thing? Oh, this is pretty cool, though. Oh, this is going to hurt. Okay, actually, no, I didn't do that much damage. All right. Oh, he gets melted, though. I mean, this is no more difficulty, of course. Uh, I'm still going to switch units, though, because I'm about to die. I'm going to use Gunbot to reflect this. Okay, that did not work on that. <laughs> All right. I don't know if this was in the uh, last open test, because, um, obviously, during the last open test, I didn't... What the... F Bro? He just... Okay, he's back. I was about to say, he just fell off the map. During the last open test, I didn't play, um, adventure mode at all. All I did was play PvP the entire, uh, time when I was playing. It's pretty cool that you actually have to fight the boss, though. I'll tell you that. Uh, let's switch to Mihawk. I think my Mihawk, uh, should be doing a lot of damage to this. Alright. Yeah, my Mihawk melts this thing. There we go. Eviscerates. Yeah, this Mihawk is crazy strong, as I remember. I mean, I'm just eating a bunch of damage since I'm just standing under it, but honestly, it doesn't even do that much damage anyway. Oh god, that guard breaks. So, like, I don't, I don't really care to block this. Alright, you should be dead here. Uh, I want to finish it off with, uh, Madara, because I want to get as much damage as... I mean, I want to get more EXP with him. I'm pretty sure that's how that works, if I remember it. There we go. S rank. Alright, nice. Alright, let's return to the lobby. Next stage would be Sand Invasion, but yeah, I'm not going to do that. Now, let's go back into PvP. I'm going to keep it a buck. The combat still does seem the same. It doesn't feel different at all. The combat still kind of does feel a bit clunky. I got to play a little bit more to verify it, though. Alright, we got another match. This time, we're going to play Zenitsu. I don't know, man. It, this thing just feels uh, a little weird. And this guy is playing... Bro, it's epic, thank... <laughs> What the hell? Three, <laughs> this guy's from two, my stream. One, <laughs> okay, go. but yeah, the gameplay doesn't feel... What the hell? Is this gonna skill spam again? Thunderclap and flash. There we go. Big damage. Alright, nice. I'll use evasive. It catches my evasive. Okay. Sixfold. Okay, sixfold does not work on him. Yeah, the gameplay, it feels exactly the same as I remember it. Like, you just skill spam. Nice. Okay, uh, Thunderclap and Flash. Oh, that's Hyper Armor, nice. Come on. M2, nice. Sixfold, nice. Woo, he's dead. Yeah, the gameplay does feel exactly the same. It's literally just, like, the same thing from the open test. Like, it doesn't feel different at all. But, I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe they did change something, but I just don't realize it. But this doesn't feel different. I'm gonna keep it a bug. This doesn't feel different at all. And I'm pretty sure people are going to say the exact same thing. It doesn't feel different. There you go. M2 him. Another more combo. I'm going to use evasive here. Uh, Thunderclap and Slash. Nice. M2. Uh, why well, did not take me into the air with him? That was weird. Whatever. Thunderclap and Flash. What? That didn't kill him? Okay, let's use 6 foot. Oh! Bro, what is that hitbox? Like, wh I'm literally under the beam and it still hit me. What? Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> that hitbox is not accurate at all. Let's use the sleep move. Come on, come on, come on. Alright, uh... 
Light speed slash. Nice. Alright, uh, he's dead. Is he dead? Yeah, he is dead. What'd he say? Revert Bakugo nerfs. Oh yeah, Bakugo did get nerfed. I'm pretty sure it's, uh I think I'm pretty sure I fought Epic Fan Guy in the last video I did on this game. <laughs> and he was just spamming with Bakugo like crazy. I'm pretty sure he got nerfed ever since then. Nice, good damage. Thunderclap and slash. Nice. Oh, what? Okay. Alright. That's crazy. Alright. Uh let's use six fold if we can. I gotta get him into an M1 combo to use it. Oh, he has no anims. Oh, that has hyper armor though. Oh yeah, there's <laughs> Yeah, there's nothing he can do about that. Uh, let's use this. There we go. He's dead. All right, I won. Yeah, the combat's literally the same thing. You just skill spam and you win matches. Like I, I don't know. At least, like, not every skill guard breaks. So I've noticed they, they've nerfed some characters. Not everything is guard breaking, and not a lot of stuff has hyper armor anymore. But the combat still feels clunky, bro. Like I, I don't know. It, the game is just focusing a lot on visuals and not too much on the combat. This time, let's play as uh, Minato. I forgot I have this Minato. Why does he look like that, bro? <laughs> I hate the way they do their like blocky clothing and stuff on this. Like, look at these muscles. That looks so gross. And like the models and stuff. I wish they would just do it like GPOs or something. I don't know. It just looks very weird. Go! I don't even know me until skills. I'm about to just skill spam and see what that gets me. Uh oh, that's how you throw the kunai. Oh, I thought it was just through Rezengon for Oh my god, this Ichigo is crazy. Oh, that's hyper armor. Alright. What does Blink Flash do? Uh okay, me until looking like buns. What the hell? Uh okay, that didn't do that much. Ichigo melts though. Time space for Zangon. Oh, you actually have to land a kunai. Oh, that's buns. That's buns, bro. What? <laughs> that tiny kunai projector. I have to actually land that. Uh, okay, let's see if I can land it. He has to be standing still. There's no way. And I missed. Yeah, that's garbage. <laughs> All right. Um. Wait, this character does no damage. This does like no damage. Blink flash. Oh, that does not do damage. Oh, he only has two damaging moves, I think. Well, he has three, but I don't know how I'm gonna land this one. Oh, that's a good move. Let's see. Throw the kunai. That kunai misses. Okay, yeah, Minato's pretty bad. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Let's see. A Zangon. Okay, that Rasengan's garbage. All right, yeah, I just lost this match. This Minato sucks in PvP. <laughs> this Minato's buns in PvP. What the hell? There we go. I TP to him. Doesn't do anything though. There we go. Oh, now I landed it. Nice. M2. Nice, M2. Mm-hmm. Slam him down. Nice. Odon hang on. There we go. He's dead. Alright, never mind. Maybe Mewtwo isn't that bad. <laughs> but you have to actually land your uh, time space hang on. That's not easy to land because it's a it's projectile skill shot. Okay, I missed. Great. That has a crazy end lag. I'm dead. Am I dead? Okay, I'm not dead. Uh I might be dead. Okay, yeah, this character is buns. <laughs> Mewtwo sucks in PvP. What the hell? All right, uh, let's block this. Nice. Time space for Zango. Nice. Nice. Uh, yellow flash. Let's try and teleport behind him. Nice. Oh, wow. I tried the M2. Whatever. Nice. Okay, he ate that entire Zango. That's pretty good. Okay, right, yeah. If you can land the one, you can get a lot of damage off, but you have to actually land this move. There we go. Nice. There we go. Mm-hmm. M2 him. Nice. Mm-hmm. And he's dead. Okay. Maybe I can win this. It's gonna be real close, though. It all depends on if I can land my one. Landing the one is not easy, but if he runs in a straight direction, it will land for sure. All right. Let me see if I can land it. Come on. Run in a straight direction. You know you want to. Nice. What? It landed, but... Well, I guess you can say it didn't land. I don't know. Uh, what the hell is he doing? What? <laughs> okay. All right, uh, I'm out of there. I, I just gotta land this time space for Zangon. Come on, evasive, nice. Throw the kunai item, nice. Mhm, mm nice. M2 him. What? Whatever. Go down for Zangon. Nice. Okay. Oh, I threw a kunai item, but I couldn't land anything with it. There you go. Block that. Nice. Evasive. Mhm. Mm okay. This is gonna be a close one. Throw the kunai item. Nice. And you dead. <laughs> okay, yeah. If you can land a kunai, Mewtwo's good. But uh, compared to other characters, he's way harder to play just because you have to land his skill shots. All right, let's do one more match with Modern and wrap it up. Yeah, the game it just 
I don't know. I'm not too sure I fear about it. The combat's not the best, but it could have been a lot better. I know it could have been better. Like, it just does not match the visuals. The game's visuals are, like, amazing. They look nice, but, like, the combat still kind of does feel clunky. But it's definitely not as buggy and as clunky as uh, last open test. They definitely have improved it. All right, it's the last match I'm going to do. I'm going to wrap it up with Madara. But, yeah, the game is it's still clunky, bro. I mean, I'm going to still do videos on the game, Three, but, like, two, one, I don't know if, like, it's a go. game I'd actually play a lot more off-camera. At least in the PvP department. I don't know if I'll play this a lot more when it comes to, um, just, like, being a casual game to play. What the hell? All right. Shattered Heaven. Nice. The Meteor fell on. Mato's OP as hell, though. I'll tell you that. This Mato is a must-have, probably, because this, this dude slaps. <laughs> um, all right. Uh, an evasive. Nice. Oh, well, what the hell? Gun by. Oh, wow, my gunbite didn't work. Evasive, cleave, and he's dead. Yeah, this, this modder is crazy strong. This is a must-have. Like, you should probably definitely buy that battle pass if you're going to grind the PvP in this game. There you go. Block that. Shattered Heaven. Oh, that's blockable. All right. Counter. Nice. Ribcage combo. Nice. Oh, you can combo extend with that. Am I bugs? Why can't I move? There you go. Uh, I think the only guard break... I'm evasiving that. Oh, it still kind of hit me. Uh, let's see. M1 combo. M2. Nice. Another M1 combo. Shattered Heaven. Nice. Another M1 combo. Oh, he's blocking it. There you go. He's dead. Yeah, this modder is strong as hell. But, like, if you just look at combat like this and you compare it to, like, um, ABA or AU Reborn or, like, uh... AUT or something, it's just a lot more clunkier. Like, this one, you can just feel it. It's just clunky, but I don't know. This is probably the best it's gonna get, honestly. But then again, this game isn't really even designed for PvP. PvP is just an optional mode. You're supposed to mainly be playing the, um, the adventure mode. The PvP stuff is just optional, but for what they did, it, they definitely have improved it from the last video, so I'll give them that. Uh, counter? Oh, he didn't hit me. Alright, there you go. M1 combo. And he should be dead. Is he dead? Oh, he's not dead. Shattered Heaven. All right, now he's dead. All right, GGs. They definitely have improved it from the last video, but eh. Like, if I was looking for a PvP game to play, I wouldn't go to this game first. But yeah, when it comes to PvP, uh, I don't think this game works when it comes to PvP. The PvP is just still too clunky. Like, if you compare, if you were to play this game and compare it to like I don't know Heaven's Arena or YBA or GPO or ABA or even project slayers or demon fall for example like the pvp is just way more smoother not saying those games don't have balance issues they do <laughs> this is way clunkier than those games pvp but oh uh, yeah anime wars it's finally released if you guys want to play it the game is finally out now for free i'll probably won't do another video until like a new unit that i care for drops like if the next update is like some unit i don't care for i'm probably not gonna do a video but, but there's one thing this game does well which is the adventure mode if you like anime mania definitely play the game's adventure mode but if you're trying to come to this game looking for pvp i wouldn't come to this game first there's tons of other roblox games you can play instead of this one but i'm curious let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section are you guys gonna play this game for pvp are you guys gonna play this strictly for the adventure mode let me know down below that's gonna do it for me i'll see you guys later take care Forever